You're watching 41 Action News. I'm Cynthia Newsom. This is 41 Action News. A Missouri man is accused of flying to California and starting several fires there. Uh, this is 61-year-old Freddie Graham of Lone Jack. Prosecutors said that he threw flaming pieces of paper from his rental car onto the grassy foothills near San Francisco. Police arrested him as he returned his rental after a witness wrote down the license plate number. Graham faces 15 arson-related charges. A new hotel could soon make downtown Kansas City home, the Cambria Hotel. A brand is planning to build a six-story, 149-room hotel at the southwest corner of 9th and Wyandotte. The Business Journal said it would be next to the 21C Museum Hotel and John's Big Deck. The hotel would open sometime in 2021. Well, there's a free screening today of the movie Emmanuel. It's a documentary highlighting the church where the infamous Charleston shooting took place. After the movie, there will be a panel of local faith leaders and Kansas City police discussing what happened at that church. The event starts at 530 at the Uptown Theater. Now, here's meteorologist Gerard Bailey with your forecast. Thank you, Cynthia. Today is going to be gorgeous. Already tons of sunshine will top out in the mid to upper 70s with low humidity feeling like a great fall day. Unfortunately, it's not going to last as we head into Friday. A front's going to arrive. We'll see our temperatures warm up and it will get pretty windy out ahead of that. But we are looking at rain becoming likely, especially later on in the afternoon and evening. Showers and storms will fire up along this front. Some of them could be even strong to severe with some damaging wind or hail and uh, even some uh, potential for a little bit of flash flooding if we see multiple storms in the same spot. So uh, we'll be after watching that uh, very carefully here over the next few days. Again, we're talking about uh, the wind gusts being pretty high. Upper uh, 30s for the wind speeds here as we move into the afternoon. Wind gusts 35 miles per hour, but dropping down to around 20 miles per hour by the late afternoon and evening. Rain chances, again, as we talked about, go way up as we move into the overnight hours, especially on Friday. And unfortunately, the rain does last a bit into your weekend. Saturday looks to be likely. Sunday, we'll see a few lingering showers, but it will not rain the entire weekend. That's the good news. Remember to get all your latest news and weather updates anytime on KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.